Hi, guys. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to Vicky's Likes. And today is the 4th of July. Oh, yes. The birthday of this great nation that welcomed us, and we have become Americans. We love the country. Proud. Yes. So uh, stick around because we're going to unveil the new growing area. It's not quite finished yet, but it's like 90, 98%, yes. you know. You'll see, stick around, okay? So we're gonna start with the blooms because today there is a heat advisory for this area yes. in Florida. That's the price you pay to live in paradise. <laughs> All right, so let's go, let's start. There's the pollinator. <laughs> so this one we got from the Central uh, Florida Orchid Society. And um, what was the name of the? Florida Orchid House. Florida Orchid House. And let's see the tag. Uh, Still in bloom. If you watch our uh, last video of our blooms, this plant still giving out beauties. And you baptized it, uh, the witch's hat? The witch's hat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Emmanuel liked the, the name, the nickname. <laughs> <laughs> this and area smells really good. So here. good. What do we have here? This one is right down here. Very nice smell. Oh, yes. Beautiful flowers. It's got the two spikes. We still have uh, flowers coming up. Next down here, do you remember no, this plant? No, this one's confusing me because there's two labels here. Oh. Cerisium and then Colmarie, I think that's what it says. Yeah. We got this plant from uh, Banjong when we went down to South Florida, and we have several videos out of uh, the nurseries down in uh, Homestead, Florida. And this has a delicious, oh, delicious Oh, yes, now cravings. I remember. Sorry, but yeah, I remember now the color, the deep color. Is, it was the one that was hanging. Uh, well, they were all hanging, but... <laughs> <laughs> Hang in there, Vicky. Hang in there. It was, um, I remember the area that it was hanging. Yeah. Next up. Oh, so this one, let me see if I could just like, Memoria Ted Carter. Uh, that, this could be a, a Lowe's rescue. This is from Goodwin Orchids here. And, uh, oh, here's the tag down here. Denise Yonana Hybrids New. Yeah. And this baby has piped twice already. This is the it second. The two spikes. Yep, yeah, yeah, the second bloom in, what, two months? <laughs> This is beautiful and they smell so delicious. They do. Next up. This is from. Um, well, we don't oh, have any no, flowers. Oh, no, this one doesn't have any flowers. This is my, uh, one of the fells. Oh, you put it on the board. Thank Hello. you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I love and it. I have pictures of uh, the little process. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember, if you haven't watched that video. Um, couple of holes that we uh, we showed this board that we got from the Volusia County Orchid Society show and we bought those uh, mounds yes. from Raider Orchids. Orchids and what I did I removed the board and I used the basket to mount it on this board. I looked I sounded surprised because I had not come around in the last few days. Now, we missed something back uh, down here. Oh, yes, we did. 
Nope. Oh, not this one. <laughs> this is the one that uh, was at your dad's, oh, yeah. I think, right? Yeah. Uh, oops. And the tag oh, is there, the right? Tag, yes. This Oops. is the one that we got from Ritter Orchids at the Vero Beach uh, Orchid Society show. Yeah. You can see that we have a lot of Phalaenopsis here. We told you all that we had a lot, and we still do. <laughs> Look at this one. Remember this one? This one we got from uh, Atkins at the oh, uh, okay. Raider Orlando show. Still has one flower hanging mm -hmm. from the old spike. And guess what? There's there another. Was, there was a main spike here. And it created another one. Developed another one. So we're going to have flowers again. Yes, very nice. Yeah. They all look very, very healthy. Now look at the that Nova T file. And this is obviously from uh, Braden Orchids. As soon as you see the tag, you know uh, where it comes from. And it smells delicious. Have you smelled it? Mm -hmm. No. Oh yeah, it's so soft. Yep. This Vanda here is from Goodwin Orchids. Yes. And, um, oh, here's the tag right down there. Yeah. And still developing. So we'll show it to you in the next uh, R Blooms. This is an old, you call it Happy Face. Yes. The yellow one. That is uh, soon to be open. Great. This plant here we got from uh, Pam's Orchids in Bloom. Um, and... I can't grab the tag. Oh, there it is. We did a, a little live there um, around my birthday. Pam Waters was very nice, and she uh, bought a cake for, for us, actually, because, again, it was our birthday month, mine the 4th. Vicky's the 29th. Thank you for all the birthday wishes, you all. <clears throat> this is a beauty. It sure is. Look at this, guys. Look at the size. You want to put your hand there so they, uh, they know? Big flowers. Mm-hmm. Uh, you're missing stuff on the bottom. Oh. <laughs> this we got from um, uh, online from Etsy. Uh, we have a video on that. Do not buy orchids online. However, if uh, you know the vendor, reputable people, please do. I bought it. I had a bad experience with a zygo that finally died, didn't make it. Um, this is, uh, again, a little fowl that we had, mini fowl. And the yellow one in the back there. Yeah. No ID, right? No. Mm -hmm. No ID. But, listen, Vicky loves uh, fowls and... I do. I do too. So all this area here, since is, uh, you know, it it's 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 got it gets more water intentionally, because I have all the vandas on this side. So all this uh, all this area here, I made it phalaenopsis, and they're doing they're looking a lot lot better, guys. Okay, I have the jewel orchid right here. Uh, mimicking, you know, the bottom of the the forest or uh, how they they live in the wild. Uh, we have uh, those files there with keikis. This is uh, hopefully it's going to bloom this year. The uh, National Orchid uh, 
of uh, Panama, Panama, Peristeria, Alada, uh, and continuing on with the blooms, okay? Because this is what this video is all about. <laughs> this beauty we got from uh, Orchids in Bloom, and still in bloom. In full, this full, one, full. We got last year from Goodwin Orchids. Yep. Vicky loved it I when we. Do. Uh, oh, here's this. We got last year from we uh, when well, we did the, yes. the video uh, from Goodwin Orchids, and they specialize in vandas. Please watch that video. And if you ever go uh, to Lee's, come to Leesburg, go to their nursery. nursery. And then here we have the semi terreds and um, the is. Macaras. This is a beauty. Mm -hmm. So I've been transitioning the Macaras that we got from um, Lady Vanda uh, from the Vero Beach Orchid uh, Society show and this is what happened. I think I rushed it, so I got some uh, sun damage, oh. okay, but they have new roots, new roots, so, you know, hopefully the plant is not, like, necessarily uh, with big, big time damage. How uh, long did it? In how many days? Did uh, you know, I have to find out. I'm going to, um, if anybody knows the transition period when you buy Macaras like that and um, how long the transition is from shaded to full sun. And how long did it, was it that they got sun burned like that? Uh, I put it out and I noticed uh, two, three days later. Oh. What happens in Florida, you know, it's, it's, the sun is shining like that, you yes. know, it's cracking the rocks, and then all of a sudden you get uh, rain, and then uh, we go back to this. Yeah. So that's, uh, that's the only uh, downfall. Um, this one back here is a beauty and smells delicious. Um, Do we have a tag? I, I don't see one here. Do you? I don't think so. No. I don't think I we don't have a tag. See it. This is another beauty that uh, we got from Paradise Orchids. This one has a tag. Here it is. Papillonanda. And it's just a beautiful. It really is. Right? We love that combination color. The color is so beautiful. Yeah. And look at this one, also from Paradise Orchids. Uh, I can't see the Papillonanda heroin. Is that how you pronounce it? Mm -hmm. I can't see the name well. Yeah, but it's a beauty. They are all beautiful, yeah. right, Jane Ann? So... Let's get out of this side of the house. Yeah, because it's, it's like... an inferno. <laughs> of course, we got the uh, epidendrums here, little flowers. Over here, we have some uh, of the dendroviums, uh, the bag babies. Not the bag babies, but no, this it counted. actually came in this kind of pot. Um, That's awesome. You, you know what? Mm, they did. They did. They yeah, did. You're yeah. Right. you're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I, can't, I, I changed the medium uh, a little bit, and it's a no ID. It's a beautiful, beautiful dendrobium, mm -hmm. beautiful flower. We have it here in the back with the um, oak tree surrounded by our beautiful bonsai um, that my husband actually takes care of. We've had these bonsai for a lot oh of years. Oh my gosh. Years um, upon years upon years. I've told you the story. Uh, I have a friend, Tommy. Tommy, if you're watching, thank you again. He um, introduced me to bonsai, which I always loved. And I introduced them to orchids. 
Yeah. So this is Virginia's mom's little bonsai. That was literally this size. This is the mother plant. And uh, I nicknamed Panda because it had, when we bought it, I bought it many years ago in the, like, mid to, like, late 90s. And we had it in the kitchen. It had a little tiny panda. So I, that's why I nicknamed it Panda. So from this baby that you see here, my husband made how many? Like oh, four we, or five? We have Isn't a bunch. that one one? No, that's not one. That one but, oh, it's in the front. I have to work on the bone size. I keep saying that, but it's a lot. And, and it's a certain season that you do it, right? Yeah, it's perhaps it's a little hot to yeah. work on them, but I'll try it because this is not acceptable. Mm -hmm. That's not, this is a flamboyant tree. That actually, is this the one that you made from seed? No, the seed one is this one here. And that one's a yellow this one. This is a yellow, that's an orange. Yeah. Let's so go back one? to the orchids. Let's go back to the orchids. <laughs> <laughs> and this one still, you know, is, is already like uh, wilting, right? Yeah. Uh, but then we have another spike right here. Let on the same see. plant. Oh yeah, I didn't see her. Yeah. So this is this is the same as the one that we attached to this young oak tree. And it had a spike for a few months, actually. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And now <laughs> it's still a work in progress, but like we said, um, and yeah, we have to use these uh, <laughs> rags that, you know, because it's, it's really hot, guys. Yes, it is. Anyway, um, so uh, it's kind of finished, but I'm, I'm going to show you. Um, we love it. We think it came out awesome. I love it. This area here, we're going to do, uh, you know, since it's uh, out here, we're going to do the uh, Hoyas. Uh, miscellaneous plants um, but I hung the vanilla orchids that we got from EFG how are they doing here um, I think they are doing fine we got to watch it here because the Sun kind of uh, you know hits some plants here so I gotta watch it and we still have uh, pañuelito. That's how oh, yes. uh, Vicky you. calls it. <laughs> this plant that we got from Paradise Orchids uh, in 2016. We got this plant and it's a Brazzabola uh, Lady of the Night. It's a beautiful, beautiful flower. And then we have someone related. This is the, and again, Night. this was a a rescue, Brasovola yellow bird. And there we have um, this plant we got from um, Orchid Trail. And, um, and this is a second spike. The plant is doing well. Oop, look, New another growth. little flower dry, dried up. <laughs> So, yep. Then we have this beauty that we got from Palmer Orchids. And uh, we got this plant also, um, she's around there. She bloomed before this one that we got at um, Redland uh, Orchid Festival from Backyard Blooms. And this plant here, guys, is not in bloom yet, but um, perhaps it's gonna be in the next Our Blooms, Caracetum, that we got from uh, Paradise Orchids. So guys, this is, look at this, okay. Um, we did the irrigation system there. And then we got the, the bars to hang plants because the idea is in winter, we have to bring all the plants from the other side over here. So we got to make room. So basically uh, we did a corrugated uh, roof 
and um, it blocks 90% of uh, the damage in uh, sun rays. However, um, I did put the 50% shade cloth that we had before under it. So it protects the plants even better. Okay, you still have the light here and they are protected. Now look at this beauty here. Oh yeah. Yeah, isn't that? Smell? Very light. Yeah. Uh, this plant we got from Paradise Orchids. And Beautiful. Wedding Song. What a oh, proper name, right? I remember right? when I, I, I did the label. Yeah, mm -hmm. it is. What a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. How many times should I say beautiful? Maybe two more times. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful flower. It is. So basically, um, this is, oh, look at this gram, how well it's doing back here. Yeah. They love water, 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 water. Uh, and he's hanging there. And of course, you all know, we love the Hanger Pot product that I've used for years. Yes. And we have all these pots that are hanging from the studs. I really enjoy looking at the plants hanging like this. I know I've said it before several times, but I really do like it. It yeah. looks so pretty. We are mounting more and more and more plants, and they love it. Um, it's cedar. We, found, we, we, we know that cedar is one of the best mount materials. Um, this is the one that I was talking about that we got from Ritter Orchids. Mm -hmm. This, uh, I kept the board and the basket. And this little guy is from Braden. And um, <clears throat> is their hybrid. And it keeps blooming and blooming and blooming. Obviously not now, but look. So this is... Uh, when we did the video, um, our viewers collection, Pete and Nelly, they were so nice and they gifted us this plant. And um, originally it was mounted like this, but I noticed that we have a growth coming around to the other side. Mm -hmm. So what I did, I hung it this way now. It looks like a swing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, so look, look at these boards, guys, and we mounted these orchids not too long ago, okay? And the plants just love these boards. Look at that. Going back to blooms, this beauty here that you, um, you cannot really appreciate, but we'll do another uh, Our Blooms video and show because look at this pike here and this is um this is this and uh pc this is what i did with the basket uh we did the encyclia, this encyclia from Braden Orchids. It looks really pretty there. And she is loving it. Yeah. Loving like her it. her own little nest. Loving it. Right? <laughs> How is the song? <laughs> <laughs> it's like her own little nest. Right? Yeah. Look at really the roots. Nice. She's loving it here. And, yeah, so basically um, this is from here down is uh, cichlias and cattleyas. And we still have the encyclia cochleata in bloom. They keep blooming. You see uh, this one coming also. So it's a sequential bloomer. 
Are those the same plants or just different same, plants, same type? Di different plant, same type. Okay. Two different plants. One okay. we got from Smiley, one we got from the Orchid Den. Same color, right? Same. Okay. Yep, same. And then we have this Encyclia back Beautiful. here. <clears throat> It's a beauty. Mm -hmm. And um, I finally uh, use this um, driftwood that we got from EFG and I uh, attached it to the back, the frame in the back. Okay, and it gives an impression of, you know, trunk. like yeah. a tree trunk. Yeah. And so I mounted one encyclia back there, and she's loving it. You can see the roots. And it's on cork, right? Uh, I put some cork there. I okay. put some uh, platinum moss. Mm -hmm. And um, I see the tag here. Oh, this is the tempensis that we got from um, uh, Jim and I at the Nature Coast uh, Orchid Society show. And then back here, look at this beauty and look at the healthy roots. She's just looking to get attached to the tree trunk. Mm-hmm. And... Uh, this is a uh, Chirac Treasure Nightingale. So that's the Nightingale. This is the uh, Kakapu bird. And this little guy that we got from the Orchid Den at the Vero Beach mm -hmm. is still in bloom. Is that the one that's called Popcorn? You are correct. Wow. <laughs> Let me see. I'm on the inside. You're on the, on the outside. Outside looking in. I am. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, finally, um, sorry, guys. She gave up already. Although she's got uh -huh, new yes. blooms. This is Vicky's mom's plant from the 80s or 90s. Oops. My glasses. Uh-oh. <laughs> They're okay. <laughs> and this plant, we're going to show the clip when it was in full bloom. Yes. And um, it, was, it was a beautiful thing because she started blooming right around the day, yes. uh, the anniversary of Vicky's mom's passing. Yes. June 9 and June 10. So, yeah. And she's still, you know, she's got... Look, uh, spikes this one here, here and there. And it still smells so beautiful. Yeah. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful plant. Yes. Uh, again, is um, the Arides uh, odorata. odorata. So, um, you want to show what uh, we are uh, oh. <laughs> trying to make here? So this side here, well, don't mind. We can lower it. Yeah. We can lower it to show. Don't bother looking at this, yeah, this side is because a mess. it's still, still work in progress. But see how we have the, um, the cloth. Shade cloth. It, it, and this is, again, how much. Um, uh, it's 50%. 50%. Okay. So the sun in the afternoon comes from over here, so it protects the plants. That's why we had to do this. Yeah. And the idea of the frame is we're going to do the PVC frame right here. here. Also, another um, one here. These these are going to be the the it, they're going to be like uh, doors or windows that uh -huh. open up and down. So in winter we can attach them to the frame. And the, then put the plastic surrounding. We no longer has to uh, cover in plastic the top, but only the sides. And we snap that. But that's going to be another video. 
that's another project. <laughs> in winter, when it's super cold. Now it's super hot. Yeah. And in winter, it's super, super, super cold. cold. Okay. So it'll be one, two, three, four, five sides. Yep. Yep. Okay. Whew. Hot. Hot, hot, hot. Okay. Yes. And what you hear is the air conditioning, so that's where we're going into now. Yes, in I can't wait. Yes. So anyway, um, this is it. I hope you enjoyed it. Yes. Please let us know in the comments. How do you like it? Uh, what are your your uh, suggestions? And um, maybe no. send us pictures of your plants so we can actually put it in our videos and say this plant is from this person you we could just say your first name and then the country that you're um, at and if you're here in the US just put you know obviously US and maybe the the state and uh, we can actually share your lovely plants as well you had that idea for a long time I I'm sure glad did. she remembered because <laughs> I was thinking about it this morning yes we can incorporate great your lovely plants. minds and great hearts yes. think alive so we can incorporate your lovely plants and share it with the world. Right. So um, the email is in the description, I believe. Uh, no spams. <laughs> but send us your pictures wherever country you are yes. so we can showcase it in our videos. Yes. So the next video is going to be another viewer's collection. Don't miss it. Okay. A viewer that we met in um at the volusia orchid society show and you'll find out who that person is thank you again for watching and leave a comment we love comments a like always happy to see a like and if you haven't done so please do subscribe if you have thank you so much click that bell it'll remind you every time that we do upload a new video and um from very hot Leesburg, Florida. <laughs> and we haven't said um, oh. we haven't said this uh, for a while. Oh yes. Let's grow this channel and orchids together. Yes. <laughs> Bye from hot Leesburg, Florida. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>